This is the My Hero Academia SMP Trials of Legends. And this is an axolotl. But this isn't any axolotl. This thing is responsible for an entire war between heroes and villains. But first, we gotta start at the beginning. We start off in the trials as a small group of villains. Villains assemble! We have no food and no materials at all to our name. Let's go, boys. What is that? We each set off in our own directions with the villains heading to the east. Are you guys low on health and food as well? Uh, yeah. Bruh. I'm on three hearts. We traveled through the desert and I was struggling. Boys, I've got no sprint. Somebody carry me. To win against the heroes in our first group battle in the next week, we need to get some things fast. First, we need to find and loot a village. There's only like two weeks. Next up, we need some food. And luckily, there's some hay bales in the village. <laughs> yes, some food. I'm not going to starve. I made some bread and there was also a single tree, which is great. There's a singular tree in this entire desert. We need it for a crafting table. To get ahead of the heroes, we need to get some armor and increase our quirks level fast. We have no idea what the first event is going to be, so we need everyone to be prepared. Boys, we're the opposite of ready. We have three random quirk tokens to use whenever and wherever we need. We can use them ourselves, trade them, or even steal from others. Wait, wait, wait. Do we have to use one now? I use my first token and get the ice quirk. This quirk is pretty good, but will it hold up against things like one for all and all for one? I got freeze. I can freeze. I'm frozen. Let's go. It was the first hour in the game and we had a great plan. Wait, should we actually speed run Minecraft? Go kill the ender dragon and get a bunch of XP. <laughs> yeah, let's, do it. let's do it. We got beds. We got a flint and steel. We made a nether portal, which took ages. Am I even doing this right? Then we made our way into the nether. Wait, actually, we could kind of do with, we, could, we like we need food does anybody have food like have. enough for the team food was limited in the desert we only just had enough to go around a lot of bread anybody else need bread to stop us from hiding in the nether we have a set time inside all right how long we got what's our timer um, ten, ten, got, minutes. Uh, 10 minutes was our time so limited it would be nearly impossible to get the ender pearls and blaze rods we needed so instead we decided to leave bro i can't get out well since we're trapped here i went over to the nether desert temple to take the loot and i forgot it was trapped wait 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 wait, wait what the nether desert temple was a trap and i nearly died don't go in it. Don't go in it. I've already set off the trap. <laughs> yeah, this was a bad start for the villains. Before leaving, I set up a hidden chest with my quirk tokens so nobody could steal them. The next time I log onto the server, not only would I change my quirk, but we would also have a fully made secret villain base and mob grinder fully set up. I log onto the server with not long left until showdown time. So I find my secret token chest location and find that nothing has been stolen and decide to change my quirk. Well, here it goes. Please, come on. Electricity, really? Wait, that's so lucky. And I got the decay quirk. The same quirk as the main villain from My Hero Academia. So this must be fate. None of my other villain teammates are nearby, so I gotta start making my way towards our brand new secret base location. I find a village, steal some of the loot that hasn't already been taken, and then continue on the search for our villain base. Whoa, what's this? Wait, this loot sucks. Knowing me wait, and wait, pyramids. Wait, wait, wait. wait, what? I of course had to check out an underwater pyramid. Who knows what kind of loot could be inside here? Ow. Ooh. Oh, a trident. Wait, first try. How do I get down there without getting stuck? Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh my god, they were trapped. No, 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 no. No. While I was making my way across the ocean, Butter Jaffa was finding the axolotl. I found him! I found him! That would be the cause of the final fight. Yes! We got him! We got Blazing Blue! After making it past the village, I could finally use the Warp Gate villain to TP me into our base. Inmo! Yo, man, what's up? When I made myself inside, I took a look around the place, showed off the mending book I found in a temple, and began grinding for XP to level up with a brand new leveling sword that now has mending. Level sword. Wow, what a creative name. Anyway, I was grinding away with a casual 10k Wait, levels. What? I've got 10,300 levels. And this happened. Wait, where'd the sword go? Oh, no. Wait, did I decay it? We need some blaze spawners to make an ender chest and some potions. So I headed into the nether and began hunting for the spawn. I'm over at the, whatever the heck this thing is. Ah, Biggie, go away. It didn't take too long to find the fortress and grab the spawners and then bring them back to the base before we started the event. I made some armor and got some protection for enchantments. So I would stand more of a chance against people with the crazy high strength levels. And just as I finished enchanting, we got intel of how we can crumble hero society as we know it. It would start with the private information of the hero's closest loved ones. If we got access to this information, we would have a massive advantage in crumbling everything the heroes have. Our intel was right. The news was being broadcast. An old oil rig had become infected with some sort of virus, taking out all on board. But that's not what we care about. We care about a certain computer located somewhere on that rig. Our goal is to get in there and steal the computer and eliminate anyone who crosses our paths. We infiltrated the oil rig and started planning our moves against the heroes. We would make the villains with flying quirks scout the roof for the computer and us power-based quirks will take the heroes head on. At least, that was the plan. But not all plans work out as intended. Ah! Oh, no! Whoa, 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 who
Well, well, that kind of throws a wrench in our plans. We're now one life down from the get-go, and we only have two left compared to the heroes with three lives. This is a massive disadvantage. Here we go. Bucket go, clutch. Tap, tap, tap. I made my way onto the oil rig with the rest of the team and started searching for clues and looking out for heroes to decay. I found something interesting in a pretty high-tech looking room, but it wasn't what we needed. There's blood everywhere. I got some findings. Uh, Something about people vanishing. It wasn't a clue. It wasn't anything useful. But I could hear the heroes above me, so it was time to move in. I heard Butter Jaffa. I engaged combat with a hero with flight. Careful of the lingering potion. Careful of the lingering potion. Don't stand still for too long, Gingy. It would be super hard to take down if he didn't fight me on the ground where my decay is most powerful. All right, all right. Hey, oh, buttery okay. boy. Yo, what's up, Come boy? here, one for all you. <laughs> Wait, that's actually kind of scary, <laughs> come bro. Here, come here. Yeah, come here. That's you want to go? That's kind of scary, me? bro. Come on. Okay, then. Okay, come on, then. Here we go. Here we go. And... Oh, he's running. No, he's just being a... Guys, Butter's weak. I promise. Wait, hey, back up. <laughs> yeah, no, you're just a distraction, boy. Sort of. That's right. If my team can find the computer first, then we win. I just got to slow down the extremely powerful heroes who have quirks like one for all. Yo, Gingy. Oh, oh. Lingering potions. That's actually smart. I respect it. I was in combat with two of the most powerful heroes. Oh, that hurts. <laughs> okay. They had cremation and flight. So this would be hard. What? I'm lagging. I am lagging hard. Oh, my God. No, no. Guys, why am I the only one struggling? Where's the backup? <laughs> hey, brother. Yo, what's up, boy? <laughs> Gingy's such a pain in the ass. I'm not even joking. Oh, why's that? What's he actually doing? No, we're fighting it out. It's like, yo, why is he a pain in the ass, bro? <laughs> I don't want to fight you inside of a building. Why would I fight a one for all user in a building? You think I'm crazy? <laughs> yes, you're absolutely crazy. Get back here. <laughs> I fell into the water and with no way back up, I was trapped. And unluckily for me, there was a hero with very long range attacks waiting for me underneath. Yo, you scary, bro. Back away, Dabby. What the hell is that range? You picked the wrong battle. Bro. Cremation hurts. I'm in the water, bro. We made a severe mistake in this fight. We brought way too little food to survive for a long time. And this would be our downfall. After managing to get back aboard the oil rig and avoid the crazy damage of the cremation quirk, we still couldn't figure out where this computer was hiding. What would be considered the safest place on the oil rig? Safest place on an oil rig? I would assume like a central hub. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay. The computer was supposedly in the safest place on the oil rig. What is even safe about an infected oil rig? We were struggling to find the computer and the biggest issue on the oil rig was the whirlwind quirk. And it was from our own team. This quirk could completely shred your health, so getting caught inside of it was almost certain death. Oh, don't get close to me. No, 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 I'm sorry, I survived. Gingy's gonna kill me. I love to. Bruh, I lost my first out of two lives. So I would need to be much more careful from now on. While searching for some enemies, I got trapped in a roof building and Gingy was waiting for me with a bow outside. I survived on very low hearts and my food was starting to run out. Do you have any spare food? No, I don't. We should have really stocked up on more food. Even with no food, I went to go help out my teammates. Aaron, I'm coming for the backup, bro. Come on. Yeah. Rin's erasing you. I tried to help Aaron, but was stuck on the other side of this post and he got taken down. But luckily, we had some new intel. They said the computer's in a dark spot. Look at the dark so the zombies knew intel that the computer was in a dark spot. It narrowed down the place as massively it could be, but we still had to find it first. While well, we came up with the battle plan, an invis player was lurking on the edge of the oil rig. Yeah, I'm running, I'm running. Yeah, he's right here. He's got arrows in him. He's on me. Right here, right here. He's on the edge. He's on the edge. Okay, move. Get out. No, look, he's over there. Luckily, I spotted them fast, but my team were not so fast. Thankfully, a tornado <laughs> makes short work of anybody, even if they've got invis. By that pillar, I'm sniping him. Over okay, there. Okay, okay. Bye. I was searching for the dark place and knew it would be on top of one of these buildings. But because I couldn't fly, it made getting up there literally impossible. Hey, Butter Jaffa. Ku trying to hit me from the back. Uh, not really doing anything for him. I wouldn't be a villain if I didn't hit you from the back. Uh, yeah, fair. I'll give you that one. I'm running, I'm running. You can't touch this. Jeez. Oh, that was bad. A single tornado nearly took me down to my final life. I knew exactly where I needed to go, but I had no way to actually get there. And with my food running low, this was about to be my final stand. This was it. No food. And after being chased by cremation, the computer was located by the heroes, so I accepted my fate for now, but would get revenge for sure in the next event. Until next time, heroes, it'll be over for you then. <laughs> my teleport cancelled. Damn it. We're villains! We're villains! <laughs> I want to leave! I want to go home! Unless I get sent to the wrong location after warping out. What the hell am I? Hey, hey, hey oh, get oh, out of our tower, boy! Why is this my home? I, I guess yeah, why I'm making myself a home. I'm going to watch some TV. Hey, let's go! Yeah, why is this your home? Oh, wait, 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 guys, guys, don't murder me yeah, don't to me yet. Wait, 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 wait. I can explain. Well, actually, I can't explain. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I'm just going to watch TV. Don't mind me. Ow. You're the true villains. We'll see you in the next one. You guys are the true villains. You guys will regret this.
We were one point down in the overall ranking. Whoever won the most events and won the final event, they would be crowned the winning team. But that would be caused by Buster's Axolotl. So we need resources. I went hunting for lapis, diamonds, and everything we would need. And while I was doing this, the villains were making a brand new base since our old base was way too visible from above ground. Our new base was hidden deep in a mesa biome. But even that wouldn't stop the heroes from finding and raiding us. After making my way back from a nether mining trip, I was running back to our chest loot area and noticed an open chest, but no other villains were online. Who is that? Wait, you get out of our base. You've trespassed into You're the wrong place. You're gonna try out. You're gonna try this. <laughs> yeah, but punch bow. That That's the best way. Punch bow. Jeez, okay. What's your damage? Oh, oh, I'm the fly hero. You're the very hurty hero. Now get out of my base. I was only level 60 going against a super overpowered hero. Quite a bit of damage to you, it seems, uh... You're doing a lot of damage. Like, I'm about to die. Like, I'm not, I'm not even the combat oriented guy. This is odd. What level are you? Like, 105? Well, that makes a lot more sense then. I'm dead. It's over. Goodbye, villain. I was so close to getting you out of our base. No. Oh, you killed all the animals. I don't care. They're unnecessary sacrifice. No. I stood no chance against him, but I still couldn't let him do as he pleased. Wow. You're supposed to be a hero and you're just attacking for no reason? Get out of my base. You're a villain. Get out of my base. You're a villain. God. That's right. And don't ever come back. Of course he came back. That is our enchanting table, villain. You will not get away with this. Can I help you? That's my side, enchanting table. Anvil. That's my anvil. I have ah. Nothing to like damage you. I keep thinking you're the villain because yeah, you're, villain, I? you're raiding us. Right. Started this with me. Why do you do so much damage? I'm getting that enchanting table back. I'm getting that thing back if it's the last thing I'm I do. I'm just taking the one Aaron took from us. I think that went well. We only lost our enchanting table, anvil, books, lapis, and ender chest. These oh. supposed heroes were stealing and pillaging. So we villains needed to put a stop to it and fight back. And to do that, we broke into a school and took three hostages. Our current objective remove the hostages to lower the heroes' lives and take out all the heroes. If we manage to win, this would be the beginning of the end. All right, let's do this team. Let's do this. Kill them all. I made my way into the hallways of the school and was already face to face with three heroes. Hey, this is revenge for last time. Oh, Jinji's here as well. Oh, Brilliant. Up, oh, there's three on me. Come on, Coop. Coop, where are you going? Kill him. Boys, where's the backup? Hey, oh, super devil. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. Crap, it's still getting me. Tornadoes. The main way to deal damage, but also take damage. But that wouldn't stop me. Get him, Kafers. Get him, get him. Is it hurting, Nathan? Is it hurting? Nathan's got to be weak. Bro, Super Devil, you have a gun apple on. How are you not dead? Come here, Taser gun. Oh, the Taser's running. Where do you think you're running, boy? I'm dead. No escape. Let's go. Wait, Kafers, you stole my kill. Wait, Nathan. What is Nathan doing in there? I need a hero. Get him. Oh my god. Well, we lost a life, but took two in the process. The destructive power of the heroes and their tornadoes inside of a building. What in the heck? Made it so if you got trapped, it was game over. I went back in with new targets and we had already taken down one hostage, but the heroes had already saved one hostage. This was a fight for the final hostage and who would gain the advantage. Hello, Jinji. This is revenge from before. I'm just going to kill you now. Get here. Come 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 if you can catch me. If you can catch me. Nom nom is there, guys. No, I, we killed two. We killed nice. two. Nice, nice. The heroes were on their final life, so it was time to be super aggro and take them out. You need to run from me now, boy. Super Devil's behind. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. I'm backing get up. Him. I'm backing up so you can use Tornado. Okay, I got him. I got, I'll get him then. I'm dead. Yet another Tornado finished me, and I was down to my final life. This was our last chance to take down the heroes and win the battle. Come on up. Come up to the roof. Come on, Kip. Where is Gigi? Why would I fight you on your own terms? Come on. I mean, of course I'm coming anyway, but I'm not fighting you out here. You're out of your mind. I encountered a new problem. The heroes with flight quirks were using it to their advantage. And with me having a decay quirk, I was not in a position to take them on. Come on, fight me. I'm not fighting you in the open. <laughs> hey, Alex, where do you think you're what? running to, boy? We took out a hero for good, but lurking in the building behind us. Let's go! It was an invisible butter jaffa with one for all 100% active. <laughs> Oh, shit. The final battle went down on the rooftop and the villains were victorious. Let's go, Inmo. We brought it back by one point. That means there is still hope for us to make a change. After that fight, I realized something crucial that had been stopping me from being able to take down any heroes. Decay kind of sucks. So I used some new quirk tokens to hopefully get a better quirk like flight, whirlwind, or erasure. I got cremation. Hey. Hmm. Do I use the last one and just get what I get? Yes, uh, I think I'll give you my yeah, token. Yeah, All right. Yeah, Mila has yeah, also, token. Also, Watch you get decay again. Bless. Oh, no. <laughs> Bless. <laughs> RNG, come on. Come on. I got decay again. No! <laughs> <laughs>
I was cursed with decay. It looks like being Shigaraki was meant to be, but I was hit with a proposition from one of the heroes. I'm here to make you a deal of if you join I heroes accept. for a week, which you, yep, yep, yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I became a hero for a week, then I can change my quirk to anything I wanted. So of course I said yes and changed to whirlwind. I can now fly and create tornadoes. So I was unstoppable. Right. Be gone, villain. <clears throat> Mila, run away. <laughs> Look, you can't act as a hero. Hey, You're a hero. get out my tower. There's a new fledgling hero, actually a villain. We went on a trip into the end and got ourselves some elytras. Teleportation yeah, my open. Other, my, my quirk. Yeah, my yeah. teleportation Wait, quirk. did I just decay the elytra? These elytras will be great for travel and helping out some other villains who couldn't fly. But we could not waste much time in the end. While we were in the end, Ginger Shadow had betrayed the heroes and joined the villains. He took Butter's Axolotl, Blazing Blue, and this would be the key turning point for how the final battle takes place. The next battle was to take place on a campsite, but the heroes didn't know that I was a double agent and I would never betray my villain companion and couldn't make it to this event. But the final event, I would be able to show off my whirlwind quirk. But hang on, do we get a random quirk? My new quirk. Half hot, half cold. I could work with this. The final event. King of the hill. Whoever stands on their podium for five entire minutes removes the spawning from the other team. Whoever takes down the other team and wins gets access to Butter's Axolotl blazing blue and decides what to do with it. This would decide the fate of the heroes and the villains. Yeah, that's right. An Axolotl is deciding our fate. Oh, we're starting. We're starting. Let's win, team. Let's win. Ooh. This is cool. We made it inside and it was a maze with markets and hell and ice caverns everywhere. Whoa, it's a maze. Strength in numbers, Drake. Bad news though, the heroes had already found the objective and the villains were massively slacking behind. Oh. What you chilling at? Oh. Hey. Oh wait, he's at the place. Don't touch me, bro. You defend down there. Go defend down there. That's, that's hitting me. Go defend down there. Prominence burn. Butter Jeff and Prominence burn. Damn it. Die. Where's the way through? This place is useless. We found the podium and started building up some points for the villains, but we were missing four of our teammates. Hey, Nathan. Get off the point. I'm burning. I'm burning. Yeah, there we go. Get off. I know the way to get... Guys, they're getting so many points. We lacked manpower to take the points. I kept pushing in aggressively and doing as much damage as I could. Die, everybody. Die. Kill them all. Before being taken down. Hopefully, some of my team survived to get us some points. Die, boys. Die. Guys, I'm guarding the point. I'm guarding the point. Hey, you back up. Frost field. Taste pain. Taste pain, butter. Guys, I'm still on here. Where's the backup? I'm out of stamina. Nathan, no. Get spleefed off. Get spleefed off. Our pressure place disappeared. Our pressure place. I was on the point for such a long time, fighting solo against the hordes of heroes that kept trying to attack me. And during that fight, our pressure plate got destroyed. So some of those precious points we needed were lost and the heroes were gaining a massive lead. I'm chilling on the point. I'm chilling on the point. So many particles. How are you not taking... What? Half hot, half cold, baby. I ain't burning. <laughs> You'll have to come and challenge me on the point instead. Oh, God. Ow. Come here, Butter Jaffa. Come here. I'll beat you up, Butter. <laughs> <laughs> ah! How oh, Nathan, go away, man. <laughs> go away. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Surely that was a huge amount of points. If the villains could get back on the pressure plate, we would be able to win this fight and destroy the heroes. Knock Gingy off. No, 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 no. Taste frost field. Even after I was taken down, I used my frost field ability so it would remain on the field and continue doing some huge damage to the heroes. After being taken down, I respawned and the worst possible thing happened. I'm sleeping. Yes, I gotta get to the pressure plate. Die, Buttery boy. They're boys. Die. They're kill them. Kill them. The heroes got enough points on the hill and took down our beds. So this was looking bad. All right, zombie, we just gotta survive now. We gotta survive. Current objective, survive. We need to get on the pressure plate somehow. With our forces being dwindled down, the remaining villains couldn't get the last of the points we needed and stop the heroes from spawning. Unless? Unless? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, keep it sneaky. Yeah, yo, I'm hearing these boys. It's survival of the fittest, but I'm not the fittest. I'm sorry, I gotta get through, Butter. I gotta get through. I gotta get through. I gotta get to the pressure plate. I gotta get to the pressure plate. Die, Buttery boy. Die. No, Gingy, now's not the time. No. Come on. I'm going down swinging. <laughs> Come on! I've got my plate going. Oh, he spilled the lava! No! Yes, no! no. We had lost everything. The heroes won after a long battle. We were being locked down and it was over. The heroes don't know now, but we will have our revenge.